Matthew, what, what was the attraction? I mean, the role is certainly. Uh, I was uh, I was about to be deported back to Wales. <laughs> <laughs> which that's good, good reason. Yes. Um, so immediately, as has been mentioned, it was it was the writing that was uh, the huge immediate draw and um, many Brits, you know, we schlep out here trying to steal jobs from the Americans <laughs> <laughs> year after year. Inappropriate Yiddishism. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but I hadn't, I, you know, and I'd, I'd sort of come with my pack on my back, but I hadn't read a pilot like that in, in, in many years. So I was, I was just lucky to be given the opportunity to, to audition for it. And then um, everything else took its course, thankfully. And you, and you really hide that accent really well. Not, thank you, not actually, <laughs> not all the time. There was, there was a moment when Ken was directing, I can't remember the last episode, and he shouted, Kurt, could you not sound like you're from Middle Earth? <laughs> <laughs> Initially, my, my, my greatest aim was, was to sound as much, especially like the boys, like Balthazar and Dave, uh, as possible. That's, that was my initial benchmark, so that we would sound the same. So a lot of the time... You can actually imitate Dave. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> if I've had enough beer. So that was that, that's what initially I wanted to do, was just... Uh, my hope was that we sounded the same, uh, and then went from there, really.